12.30 in Nuremberg right now, and we're just scrambling to get a bunch of stuff packed because we are going to catch the sunrise in the town center. We had Germany checking out from the apartment which was rented for about five days. Well, five days is nothing compared to about 15 suitcases. Now, what are they here for? Uh, technique, all over the place. Technique, yes, camera gear, drones, cloth, chargers, and much more. Whose is that? Amazing Discovery Canada. What are they doing with it? Recording that guy. Who is that guy with the back? It's Walter. Walter, comment? No comment. got a bunch of shots from the top of the castle here. So we just finished our first morning of recording. We recorded at the castle up top and we recorded at this just really quickly on our way out at this statue. Just squeezing down. Okay, come this way a little more. This way. Yeah, now turn. It's all in a day's work with amazing discoveries. Off for television. Oh. Uh -huh. 50%. We're here in the cellar, and you may not believe what it is. It's the very cellar of the 
Wittenberg Church in central Germany. Sachsen, that is the region we are in here, is the actual foundation of Reformation. And we made it to come in here by that hole, which is about four meters up there. And the door was open. And we were able to go down here on a very steep valley. And we're standing here right next to a tomb. And it's unbelievable. You can maybe hear the sound to be here. There's a dead body underneath. It could be either Martin Luther himself, who is buried in this very church, or it could be one of the saints, they call it, because we saw the inscription 1273. What a privilege is to be here. And we went to explore some of these narrow ways right underneath in the basement of Wittenberg Church. And as we just go up there in a minute, you can see the actual 95 Thesis nailed here for Martin Luther to start the Reformation, which has divided the Catholic from the Lutheran Church. And it became a movement that God predicted and wanted to happen.